Here we have a Colin mini split thigh back conditioner in my paternal relative's house. This is in this little spare room here, which I use as a bedroom and a study room. Sometimes, even really, even every really actually slept here. This vacation, I just it's, it's like a casual room to hang out and study and go in my phone and do stuff. So, anyways, this room did not use have an air conditioner. This air conditioner is new. Instead, they just had a ceiling fan, which is this little hunter quiet breeze or flooded <laughs> breeze. I'm not that sure what. So yeah, now we got both, which is even better. We got a ceiling fan and an air conditioner, which can work. And, you know, and we all know that ceiling fans and air conditioners can work in conjunction against the air conditioner with like a high temperature. I I set it at like 27 yesterday, and I just turned up the fan, which probably saved quite a lot of energy. So anyways, first of all, I'm gonna show you the tag. Tags. Apparently, Colin is a Philippine brand. Maybe this is just a Philippine branch of the Colin brand. I don't know. Mm. Here, just a little, got a little carry, a box of a carrier air conditioner and an older Colin one. This apparently is, is, is what the newer carrier air conditioner in the massive better replaced. I think my aunt just placed it because the, the newer one would be more efficient. But I don't know where what, what they're gonna do with this. Hopefully it's not gonna get dropped. Here's the outdoor unit. Got this little tag here. Lot number and serial number are gone. That. There's the fan. I don't know what these numbers on the fan is. I don't know what those mean. So, anyway, I'm gonna. Turn this on for you, but. Actually, first of all, I'm gonna show you the remote. I don't normally have this set all the way down to 17. I'm just doing that for the video, just to make sure it runs continuously. I'm just gonna set the fan to low, just prepare it for the video. The video. Two triple A's in there. Anyways, I'm gonna turn the ceiling fan off just to give you a better, a better idea of airflow and sound. So, anyways, first of all, I'm gonna show it to you starting up from the inside on low little fan this is no one else in this room this is, this is, this is not my my family except for my room this is my family and stuff are not in this room again probably just do a Proper video showing all the speed and with and without swing and stuff like that. There's mist coming off, coming off this unit. Maybe, maybe it's humid today. I'm not. Sure. Whenever there's mist coming out of air conditioners, it's usually an indication that it's humid. We see no air, con water vapor condensing, stuff like that. <sighs> Moving okay, I don't know. I like low speed of air conditioners being really slow, though, so we can have a with low speed on air conditioners. It's really meant, it's meant it's really meant to be like a draft preventer, so we can cool the room without getting too much cold drafts. Medium. Oh, I, for, I keep for, I forgot to show you the low sample. Open the door, but 
set it to medium. And high. Moved and it came out of air. I'm gonna turn I'm gonna bring it back to low and turn the swing on. Move okay air once again. I'm just going to skip straight to high. This video is already 6 minutes long. <sighs> I was trying once to see if we could make the ceiling fan spin with this air conditioner on high, but it didn't really work. It worked once, years ago, but I don't know why it doesn't work anymore now. Anyway, it's going to give this. I'm going to show you the spin now. Indoor unit. Anyways, that's about it. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the outdoor unit.